So you've also said, no, I'm quoting from your Twitter feed, no, uh, you've said in your recent tweets that the meaning of full vaccination should now include a booster. Why? Because, sir, um, um, we've seen in studies uh, Israel, US, uh, UK, na ang outcomes of people who got their booster is much better than those who didn't get the booster, especially for those who are 50 and above. And um, it has something to do with uh, the fact that antibodies wane. Um, and this is normal. So sa lahat ng diseases with vaccines, um, of course, after you get the, uh, the vaccine, your antibodies will shoot up. Pero hindi po siya magsa-stay dyan sa high level for a long time. Kasi it, it's, it, we can't possibly have high antibodies for every disease or every pathogen that our body has faced. Diba? Mm-hmm. Hindi talaga pwede yun. So bababa siya when uh, uh, after a few months, bababa talaga ang, ang antibodies. I think five, six months. Um, for flu at least. For COVID, it seems like it's four or five months bumababa na yung antibodies. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And this is the reason na yung mga taong na boost. So when you boost uh, a person na vaccinated na, biglang aakit ulit yung antibodies niya. And then you will have all these neutralizing antibodies to fight the virus if you're infected. Mm-hmm. Kasi yung, yung semantics nito no? matter a lot. No? Kasi pag sinasabing fully vaccinated na, parang uh, okay ka na, di ba? Kahit may sinasabing booster. Kasi parang the booster sounds like an option. Yeah. Parang nagpa-boost ka lang, pero okay ka na, okay. Uh, even without the booster. Is that what you're saying? Kaya dapat baguhin na yung definition ng uh, full vaccination to include three doses or the two initial doses plus the booster na dapat parang ituring na natin na uh, third dose in a full vaccination kind of um, ano, uh, pag sinasabing full vaccination? Well, ideally, sir, yes. Kasi, you know, with other diseases that we we have vaccines then, um, you actually need three doses. Um, HPV, for example, you need mm-hmm. three doses. Um, some of the um, yung combination vaccines that we're getting, like diphtheria, tetanus, um, these vaccines, you need three doses as well. So it it's kumbaga hindi siya malayo na three din pala ang kailangan natin for covid. And the only reason that we have two vaccine, two doses for covid is kasi nung ginawa siya, syempre yung yung ideal situation is just two doses, 'di ba? Um and now we're seeing na better pala ang three doses compared to two. Okay, mataas yung two doses rate natin no kasi nabanggit mo nga mataas yung vaccination rate but pag sinabing mataas ang vaccination rate mataas yung rate ng dalawang dose yung yes. tinatawag na full yes. vaccination pero mapapansin natin na mababa yung rate ng booster no mm-hmm. um, it's lagging behind uh, yes. the rate for full vaccination no? so ano ba yung risk kapag uh, fully vaccinated ka with two doses pero hindi ka nagpa-boost no ang um ang battle between our immune system and the virus um, it's it it's always about uh, speed yung speed ng pag develop ng antibodies so if you if you have been vaccinated pero kunya sabi natin 6 months na and your antibodies are lower na because antibodies uh, decrease normally if you encounter the the virus um konti lang ang antibodies mo to fight it and um if you if you are infected with a high viral load kumbaga madaming virus ang nag-infect sa madaming particles viral load and you only have very few antibodies then madaming mga uh, viral particles na mag-infect sa and can do damage to your body pero if you have been boosted at mataas ng level of antibodies mo the chances of you getting infected and uh, getting severe disease will be lower kasi nga madami silang nandyan na to fight the virus. So kumbaga, if you compare an unvaccinated person sa dalawang dose lang, okay pa din talaga ang two dose. But better ang three doses kasi uh, kumbaga na-remind ulit yung katawan mo about this uh, um, virus and yung antibodies mo, kumbaga mas mataas siya. Three doses are better than two in terms of COVID. Hi, I'm Howie Severino. 
check out the Howie Severino podcast, an original for GMA News and Public Affairs. New episodes will stream every Thursday. Listen for free on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, and other platforms.